Here, a bridge connects the past and the present. Here, a revolutionary shrine glorifies our nation. Here, a city manifests the ancient rhyme. Here, a river embellishes the city across which it runs. Here, a chain of mountains shines upon the beauties at sight. Xu Jiajuan, the capital of Hebei Province, which rests at the east foot of the Taihan Mountains, is closer to Beijing, the national capital, than any other provincial capital in China. And within two hours' transportation, one can arrive at the capital of Shandong, Shanxi, and Henan Province. As a core city and the third pole at the Beijing Tianjin Hebei World Class City Cluster, Hebei Province has established a transportation network of expressways, high-speed rails, and airport, traversing the east and the west, as well as the south and the north. Jingding International Airport provides non-stop flights to more than 70 cities from both home and abroad. Xu Jiajuan is now a place where the world converges. Xu Jiajuan left China is a splendid city of tourism a city of forests and a city of happiness. A tourist industry that features such items as visiting ancient sites, enjoying the landscape, visiting sites of the revolutionary bases, and touring new industry sites, clusters here, raising the curtain of its citywide tourism and turning itself into a significant pillar of the city's economic development. the oriental charms of the Han and Tang dynasties, the classic inscriptions of the Sui and Tang dynasties, its magnificent religious culture, and numerous romantic scholars have left behind multitudinous stories of memories in days gone by. Jingdei, a national famous historical and cultural city, harbors multitudes of classic ancient architectures, emitting an air as if we were a part of the Cantabile ages of the past. The Longxing Temple, which dates back to more than 1400 years ago, and the Guanyin, with thousands of hands and eyes, are still as serene and peaceful as before, blessing and guarding the happiness and safety of its people. Built in 540 AD, Linji Buddhist Temple, an ancestral chamber of Linji sect, or Ling Zai Zan, is nonetheless tolling for the delight of spirits. Eminent monks of the past dynasties were once here, carrying forward Buddhism, with their student monks scattered across the world. Nowadays, the Rongguo mansion of Ming and Qing style is still a sea of cheers and laughters. It escorts us into the imaginary space of one of the four great classical novels of China, a dream of red mansions. Jianding is not alone. Other pearl-like embodiments of historical memories are as ever dazzling and sparkling on the territory of Shu Zhejuan. Fu Xitai of Xinle as well as the beautiful legends of Fuxi and Nuba, are as ever delivering energy of love to every household. Zhongshan State of ancient China is now now the eighth most powerful state of the Warring States period. Now standing on this historical site, we can still envision the figure of this glorious kingdom. As one of the earliest bridges ever built, Zhaozhou Bridge is still sparkling with the spirit of ancient craftsmen. It is one of the world's longest and most ancient open spandrel arched stone bridges and has performed a great number of mythologies.
the thousand-year-old Bailin Temple is, as ever, enjoying a blooming pilgrimage. Legend has it that Mang Xuanzang, a renowned Buddhist sutra translator of the Tang Dynasty, was once here studying sutras before going on a pilgrimage to India for Buddhist scriptures. The ancient post rose, built when Emperor Qin Shi Huang of the Qin Dynasty was in power, had their lasting appeals despite the changes of time and era. The exquisite historical and artistic scroll paintings of the Pilu Temple are still attracting the attention of a great number of artists. The ancient towns of the Song Dynasty, the historic villages of the Ming Dynasty, the courtyards of the Qing Dynasty, and the turrets of the Republican period of China are still emitting their charms and the ancient flavor, telling stories of the past. The breaks of the Qin Dynasty and the tiles of the Han Dynasty, as well as the wind of the Tang Dynasty and the rain of the Song Dynasty, have left deep imprints on this ancient city. Mist rises among the cloudy valleys of the magnificent Taihang Mountains, constituting a world of fairness and peace. Looking up to the Shisha Mountain, the reclining Buddha is wearing a smile, initiating a grand tour of Shu Jiajuang. Stepping on mountain roads among the woods, enjoying countless flowers in full bloom and listening to the murmuring of streams, you will slow down your pace and discover the breathtaking beauty. At Tuoliang, a summer resort of ceaseless vitality, your spiritual reign of vision is to settle down. At Wu Yuejai, a natural oxygen bar, you will be intoxicated with the unconstrained self-satisfaction. At Zhang Shiyan, one of the three scenic spas of sandstone landfall, together with the Dunxia Mountain and Zhang Jiajie, you will have a wonderful experience of the world's biggest natural echo wall, which has been enlisted as one of the Guinness World Records. Standing on the bridge of the Tsangya Mountain, a key national scenic site, which hovers over the towering cliffs, you will look up to the blue skyline and look down to the bottomless abyss. At the Tengui Mountain, a renowned Taoism site known as Guilin of the North, you will have a taste of the many vicissitudes of life. The Shentai Mountain is red all over, and the forest is a depth of diverse tents. The falling red leaves are for you to appreciate, and the enchanting sceneries are for you to enjoy. At Hu Hu Shui, where water falls from every single cliff possible, you experience the vitality of water, and also the tranquility of water. The mountains and waters of the Taiha Mountains serve as ecological protective screens and add thriving vitality to this city of history. Going beyond the Yangtze River and the Yellow River, we sailed across the vast Huta River. Shibaipur, a small mountain village at the foot of the Taiha Mountains and by the side of the Huta River, writes a magnificent chapter of a revolutionary China. The historically significant Second Plenary Session of the 7th CPC Central Committee took place here. 
and the new China came walking from here. The force to stimulate the world inspired the passion of its people to make progress. The strategy of the joint development of Beijing Tianjin Hebei guides Xu Jiazhuang to its magnificent goal to cultivate a modernized provincial capital and also an economically powerful city. A modernized metropolis that features high-level industries, high-quality city, high education level, and high happiness index is to unleash amazing and powerful strength. The landscape of beautiful villages and towns of unique features is to boundlessly expand it. Tours to experience sites of new industries have become a fashionable name card for the city's economic development. Intangible cultural heritages have been passed on and carried forward by more and more new artists. Renowned local cuisines of unique features soundlessly evoke our childhood memories. Experiencing authentic hot spring bath and wandering in unique cultural streets and blocks, people can easily experience the charms of traditional culture and what is fashionable in modern life. Its citywide tourism, featuring diversified tourist attractions, brings vigor and vitality to this ancient city. Rambling among the Taiha Mountains, standing still by the side of the Huta River, touching and feeling the history, and looking down at the whole city, the revolutionary Xi Baipu and the colorful Xu Jiazhuang. The citywide tourism is to flourish. Come to Xu Jiazhuang to go climbing Taihang for mountains, waters, birds and flowers. Come to Xu Jiazhuang to go hiking in Taihang where great joy and happiness will be with you forever.